Okay, here we are at a house this week uh, off KK in Osage Beach, Missouri. This is Rick with Custom Concrete Design. Uh, we're gonna come in here and start doing some grinding. The floor is pretty raw right now. It's got a lot of, uh, the whole thing actually has to be ground down pretty good. It's got quite a bit of grinding that needs to be done. So uh, we're getting ready to uh, get it all cleaned up, kind of clean up the edges, get some of the debris off the floor. And, uh, and then we're gonna go ahead and start grinding. living room got a lot of uh, pot marks that have to be filled in this concrete's pretty aged so and then a small bedroom in here Okay, the previous pictures just before this video were basically uh, two base coats um, skimmed out. This, uh, what you're seeing right now, is the texture coat. We put that on yesterday, and um, right now we have prepped it, prepped the walls to uh, get some acid stain down. It's actually an antiquing stain, and we're going to add some color to this. After that, once the uh, antiquing stain is dry, the next day we'll, uh, we'll come in and finish it off with some epoxy. But this is how the texture coat turned out. By the way, this texture code is called the Tuscan Slate, in case you're wondering. I do this one quite a bit, actually. It's pretty popular. This basement floor in Osage Beach is now complete. Have the epoxy on it, and it is good to go. You're going to see a lot of reflections here from the wall and the outlets, some of the lights from the ceiling and of course the outside slider. But overall, I mean this thing just turned out beautiful. Go in here to the next bedroom. That was the living room. It's got some really cool effects to it. It's a little bit different everywhere. A bit darker back in this hallway. There's a whole lot of light. Natural sunlight coming in. This is the second bedroom, obviously.
and now we're going back into the utility room.